What's up, people? It's time for Season 6, Episode 12, Spice Up Your Life. Uh, We're going to be getting my life spiced up. I don't know what that means. Maybe it's uh, sexual. Maybe it's culinary. (laughs) I don't know what... I don't know what the um, meaning of spicing up my life could be. But if it's getting spiced up, that means it has to be something good. So, hey, <clears throat> that means I'm down. Yeah, I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. <laughs> yeah, I'm just going to start the episode. Three, two, one, play. Ooh, we're in the castle. Probably noticed, it's been quite some time Everyone's since the map here. has sent us on a Pretty mission main of friendship. Seven. Yeah. Ever since Starlight messed with you to go back in time and try to change history. Thanks yes, for reminding. Since then. <laughs> but as part of her studies, Starlight's been assisting me, and together we think we've come up with a spell that will get it working again. But it's not working. <laughs> get the fuck now, off the table. Without further ado. Ooh. Combining their power, that must be hella power. There we go. Oh shit! <laughs> it's like when you load up your phone again, you get a bunch of notifications. Pinky and Rarity. Interesting combination. Rarity always gets to go to the city with these fucking map summons. <laughs> Okay, Pinky. Okay. My little pony, my little pony. <laughs> I used to wonder what things should be. Has Rarity ever been called to a place that wasn't the city? Bouncing like always, Pinky. And begin to question the prop of oh, Rarity. You don't find a friendship problem, it finds you. We just need to go with the flow and eventually kaplam, we get friendship problems right between the eyes. <laughs> well, That's a, this is a team a effort. Weird way to you phrase it. We should go with the flow, then with the flow we shall go. Where's the Sounds good. saying we should go? <laughs> you know cancer lot. What do you think we should do? Yeah. Take your pick. Culture, culture, cuisine. <laughs> Cuisine. <laughs> I'm with oh Pink. My. Well, it sounds like your stomach is saying we should flow towards some lunch. I know just where to go. Hell yeah. Restaurant Row. The absolute best place for fine dining in all of Equestria. Ooh, so many choices. Where should we go? This one? That one? Those ones? All of them. Establishments that have where he's rich, he'll pay for it. Three hot or should it seduce her way? Gourmand, the queen of cuisine. When it comes to food, she is the ultimate authority in Canterlot, and that's all Equestria. She judges a restaurant on cuisine, decor, and presentation. Without her approval, a restaurant simply cannot survive. What's so important about her approval? Zesty grew up around fine dining, and every pony hangs on her every word when it comes to cuisine. Wow! Then the food here must I'll be the judge of my crazy. own food. Thank you very much. <laughs> I just love how excited oh, Pinky is for oh everything. Such presentation. Oh. Oh. Ah, <laughs> yes, very nice. It doesn't look very nice. <laughs> oh, <laughs> maybe I'm not in the mood for whatever this is. Maybe you shouldn't have eaten all three Try of them at else? once. Um, yeah. Maybe one more stop. Yeah, how much money? You're rich. Nope. <laughs> Maybe instead of trusting somebody else's hooves, I should pick the next place. I will trust Pinky with the, being a judge. <laughs> oh, 
back alley. Taste of the treat. It's very rustic. It looks like it hasn't even been rated. <laughs> Good. Goodness. Yeah. Where did you see the name Tasty Treat? Ooh, is this Indian? Are we sure they're okay? Asian? Saffron Mastala. Would you like to hear about the specials? Can We're you say thick the three times fast? <laughs> we have a great oat cake. We'll take one. And a glass sandwich that has been marinated overnight in a mustard Dijon dressing. How can we say no to that? Everything's Cajun. Oh, oh, I'm fine. Thank you. Rarity, come on. No raking. <sighs> can you say thick four times? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. My daughter cooks. I I'm not gonna <laughs> Without customers, I have no pony to host for. So I stack. <laughs> Stop it! Don't close up the restaurant around our guests. What does it matter? When they leave, no pony else will be coming in. Well, your attitude is. Yeah, I was about to say not with an attitude like that. Can't you at least pretend to be positive? <laughs> Pinky just shoves her face. Oh, good. <laughs> you are doing enough pretending for the both of us. No pony here. Well, here's the friendship problem. Anything new. I know when to throw in the towel. Uh, Pinky, perhaps we should excuse ourselves. This is the problem. Try this. Maybe if you would listen to my ideas for once. Oh, yes. I did not move halfway across Equestria for my daughter that I never listened to. Rarity, I think that friendship problem just kablammed us right between you. Yep. <laughs> These two? Oh, I don't know, darling. The food is excellent, but I'm not sure there's much you and I can do to help them. What? what no. Nah. Let me do. We can't even get Zesty Gourmand to come to our restaurant. She took one look at how empty it was and said it wasn't even worth rating. That's it. <laughs> the flow has led us here. This is our mission. We are going nice. to give you a free hoof rating and save your restaurant. I can get Zesty Gourmand here. And you can. can of course, you have connections. And how do you intend to do such a thing? Just leave it to us. <laughs> Father, Pinky licking the plate, though. When the lovely pony comes back and says she couldn't convince Zesty lovely pony. to come visit us, we will <laughs> when the sexy pony comes back. I'm just getting a head start. You really don't know Mary. I've done it. See? It took all of my charm and cajoling, but I was able to have a lot of that. Zesty Gourmand to come and try the food. What is the catch? Ah, uh, yes. Well, um, there is a bit of a challenge. The only time she can make herself available is tonight. <laughs> oh, yeah, right. We have a day to go. Oh, wow. a restaurant on cuisine, decor, and presentation. And she has very specific tastes. If she's coming tonight, there mm. is quite a bit of work that needs to get done. Like what? Uh. A tweak here, a tuck there, some slight <laughs> modifications to the menu. We just need the place to Don't be change the menu. cosmopolitan. Father, after Rarity went to all of this trouble for us, can't we at least try? Why don't I stay behind with Coriander to get the restaurant ready for Zesty's arrival? You and Saffron can try and drum up some business. One Sounds good. Coming right up. <laughs> Coriander, I understand your trepidation, but I promise you, trepidation. you get those hooks by I love Rarity's vocabulary. Just like all of the other restaurants on Restaurant Row. I hope my father doesn't drive Rarity crazy. It'll be fine. Rarity's gonna make sure that the Tasty Treat is the most unique and beautiful restaurant in Canterlot. Not like all those stuffy places on Restaurant Row. I don't know. I feel like Rarity's gonna try and shift it towards more of those restaurants. Here's what oh. I know. <laughs> fucking song out of nowhere. Just like last episode. That's the key. If you want to 
show that you've got what it takes. You must be what they want you to be. Ooh. This is a very unique song for this show. I never thought I'd get a pinky rarity duet. It's pretty catchy. Get rid of their food. Oh, we're getting mixed messages here. I agree with people. I think these city dwellers will like this. Just be the same. Trust your heart. You'll make your name. We'll help you Where are these ways the only way you're gonna get a three hoof rating? But Pinky's way is what you should do. You should know it too. It's gonna work. I know it's gonna work. It's gonna work out. Maybe you should have opened this in Ponyville. <laughs> Good song. It's almost over, and we haven't found any ponies. What will we do? Try harder. Billy's Red Gentle Coat. Check out the super stupendous and amazing cuisine of the Tasty Treat. Grand reopening tonight. How many hooves does it have? No hooves yet, but hopefully soon. So bland. Well, when it gets rated, let us know. <laughs> Stupid hooves. Look at this, hon. Oh, the tasty treat. Do you think that's a restaurant, Chuck? <laughs> yes, yes, it is. Oh, God. We came to Canterlot from Winneapolis to be adventurous. Winneapolis. So the food in all these hoity toity places tastes like some pony cooked up nothing with a side of nothing. This man well, is speaking please, facts. Come try the tasty treat. I think it's going to be exactly what you're looking for. Yeah. We got two customers. <laughs> Father, we're back. Oh, Rarity, what did you do? Welcome to the tasty oh, treat. Oh no! You can eat here if you want, or not. Who cares? <laughs> he is so done. He is sure to love it. I thought we were trying to make this the most unique and beautiful restaurant in Carolot, not make it exactly like every yeah. other restaurant. We want to help our friends by getting them three hooves. That will only happen if this is like every other restaurant. That's true, but I don't think hooves Mother, should be your goal. What is this? <laughs> that dirty secret <laughs> Oh, God. This is what we must cook if we want to succeed here. This isn't what I wanted. I wanted Cantalot to like us for us. Rarity, how could you ruin the restaurant? Okay. We can't <laughs> save the restaurant. <laughs> other guests how many other ponies are coming two just two i thought you said you could pack a place with ponies no matter what you those ponies aren't racist oh god this is gonna be a disaster Voldemort? What are you doing here? <laughs> Welcome to the Tasty Treat. What can I get you this evening? I hardly think it matters, but by all means, try your best to impress. Well, we'll I don't like you, Zesty. Maybe with a little kick to it, eh? 
Yeah, we've been craving some food with actual taste. Sapra Masala! What are you doing? I'm trying to save our reputations! I've given it at least a little bit of flavor. No, 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 no. But that's not what Zesty wants. What kind of food expert doesn't want flavor? That's <laughs> insane! It's I'm just, taking this out there! You just no! have different goals. Oh god, Rudy, what? That's landed on Zesty. I think we are done here. <laughs> Zesty, please wait. Allow me to explain. Rarity, when it comes to fashion, you are adequate. But take some advice from a Adequate? Keep your opinions out of restaurants, substandard food, laughable service, and I would think even you could recognize that the decor here is trying desperately while desperately failing. I saw your face when you walked in. You were all for it. A place such as this could do serious damage to your social standing. Disreputable? You mean a place with mm. food that actually tastes good? Tell her, Pinky. Pony can throw ingredients together and create an obvious taste that uncultured ponies like those two An obvious good hey. taste? <laughs> culinary artist to create a subtle taste. The I don't give a fuck about the artistic the value. I want it. I want to taste good art. stuff. This is an art museum, it's a restaurant. I'm so embarrassed. I don't know that there are words to adequately express how truly sorry we are. The worst has happened. No use crying over spilled food now. Here, this always cheered me up when I was younger. <gasps> oh. My spicy flat noodle soup. Oh, oh my, this is truly delightful. Should have given this to Zesty. Like the food we made together when I was younger. It has been so long since we cooked together. <laughs> Remember how you used to hide the ingredients you did not like? <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Who cares what some stuffy unicorn does yeah, the food here? That's what I'm saying. Exquisite. That's true. And you don't need three silly hoods in your window to prove it. Yeah. That's you just need ponies in here to give it a chance. Ponies that will tell every pony else in Cantalot that the taste Yeah, but we're dealing with city folk. City. With That's some Yankees. Three times three. <laughs> but without Zesty's approval, I don't mean no any offense. <laughs> try our food. Oh, yes, they will. Pinky, we are the perfect team for this. We were just doing the wrong jobs. I will go out and bring the crowd. You stay here. And make sure this place is every bit as unique oh, as switch it up. It yeah. the moment we walked in. That's a good idea. And what about us? You two? Rarity can you conjole and seduce her way. Make whatever you want and make a lot of it. I intend to bring a crowd. Who's the owner of one of the free <laughs> Seduction, the here we go. Nice. It's almost time. Is every pony ready for the grand re reopening? Before we <laughs> open, my father and I just wanted to say thank you for all of your help. We've both been so stressed about the restaurant succeeding that we forgot what it was we loved about it in the first place. Cooking is something we used to love to do together. No matter what happens next, thank you for reminding us of that. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get sappy of me. Now come on! We've got a party to throw! Oh, it's Gordon Ramsay! <laughs> Damn! Welcome to the tasty treat! Make yourselves comfortable! Comfortable! Don't come in here! Please! Feel free to sample the food! What's this? What is 
every pony doing here? This place Having a no good time. Rooms. It is not in keeping with the level of cuisine that I have set for Canterbury. I don't give up. No <laughs> told you this place was acceptable. Uh, Rarity and her friends said it was good? They told us. <laughs> They told you, and who are they? That to one's tell cute. You anything. Rarity Not Voldemort, can tell but... you what hats to wear with which skirts. Her friend can tell you how to maintain a tragic look for a pretty maid. They can hey. tell you what <laughs> food you can eat. No, we can't. She has a and cute look you. with a fluffy no maid. Right Zesty, you have very uh, specific and very strange. <laughs> Opinions about food, and that's your right. But just because you like your food a certain way, there is no reason to tell these ponies that they need to do the same. Yeah. Rarity tell is right. Them. I, for one, think the food here is delicious. I own the smoked oat on Restaurant Row. I hate the food we make. How much do you on, smoke? It's all smoked, basted, oh. and grilled. <laughs> is an inspiration. I own the bake stock. I'm going to bake my mother's bud cake the way she made it, full of flavor. There we go. We're inspiring change in unique styles. like to try the food? Ignoring a unique and fresh establishment such as this could do serious damage to your social That's right. <laughs> yeah! Let's actually eat some good food now. You are both truly amazing. There we go. Glowing ass. Mission success. <laughs> it's pisses do her. But we need mod for that. Nice, that was a cool episode. It was interesting. <clears throat> Got to see some Indian ponies, I assume. Somewhere around that region. Uh, had a catchy song. Some good moments. Uh, pretty, pretty, yeah, just good all around. I liked it. L-H-X. <laughs> yeah, that's basically all I got for this one. Uh, I love... That was an interesting combination between Rarity and Pinky. I never thought... Well, actually, I'm, I'm stupid. <laughs> Episode 3 of this season, it was Pinky and Rarity with Maud. I'm, I'm stupid. <laughs> uh, yeah, but that's a good combo. They're, they're all good combos. I'm sure by Season 9, I'll have seen every combination possible. Uh, yeah. So that's that. Uh, on to the next one. See you guys later. Peace.